As you begin to create more complex geometry, both parts and assemblies in Inventor, you may find yourself using construction geometry more frequently. Things like planes or an axis, a point, maybe even a UCS. As you add these things to your model, you'll find that they're also added to the browser, and that can cause some clutter over time if you're looking for something specific. Let me show you what I mean and how we can fix that. If we go to the browser and click the arrow to the left of the engine block, you can see all of the things that are contained within that. You can see the origin planes, you can see the work geometry that was used to create the model and the constraints that are applied to it. What you'll also notice is at the bottom of the browser, the constraints are being pushed off the bottom of the browser. And that's really because these work features, which we really aren't interested in right now, are taking up space in the browser. We can turn this off with our display preferences. You can find them under the drop down menu in the upper right hand corner of the browser. Here, display preferences list a number of things that can be temporarily removed from the browser to ease locating things you're looking for. Let me show you what I mean. If we were to hide work features, something immediately changes in the browser. You'll notice that instead of seeing the constraints run off the bottom, I'm now starting to see components and parts that are part of this assembly. If you scroll to the top, you can see that those work features that we were just seeing up here have been hidden. At any point in time, you can always toggle those on and off. The process is exactly the same. We can return to the drop down menu, hover over display preferences, and then uncheck hide work features to bring them back to the browser.